And here I am, yet with another unboxing video. So recently, one of my friends just came back from Korea and bought me like a shit ton of albums. And I'm, I was so excited, he handed me this giant bag of albums he got me and I was like, oh, damn. So I'm really excited to open all of them because some of them are like the missing pieces in my collection. So I'm oh, excited, let's get to opening them. First up, we have U184 Solo Day. And this album originally comes in two versions. This version is like the white version and like a blue version. Apparently both are the exact same thing except for the fact that the covers are different. Like one's blue, one's white. But like pictures and everything, photo cards, exact same thing. So, okay. And, b one for Bias, if you don't know yet, because it was very apparent in like some of my other vlogs, especially when I went to their concert, is Gongshan, so you gotta pray for that act, but except for the fact that I actually already bought the Gongchan uh, photo card for this album, so right now any other member is great. My garbage right here. Okay. Oh! Damn, usually I like to be surprised, but it was right there when I opened it. I got Sanju! Oh, so cute. Oh, you guys can see the reflection from the camera. Whoops! Oh, whatever. Sanjua, pizza delivery boy. Yay. Okay. Put that to the side. Next up. Okay, I think this is still in the UNA4 section. Sweet Girl. This mini album had three versions, and then if you saw in my KCON vlog where I bought the other two versions of this, the boy version and butterfly version, um, each version, not each version, they, there's three types of photo cards for each member. Five members means 15 photo cards. And there was this really one specific Gong Chan card that I wanted so badly, but I didn't get it. So I ended up buying it off of someone on Facebook. So there's a lot of choices for the photo card for this one. So we'll see. So I'll be very surprised if I get a duplicate. It's so funny, okay, so it says The destiny, each scent of B1A4 comes as one Keep reminiscing and waiting until the moment of blossom together forever I love bad English or just really sappy English Okay, let's see I'm gonna try to be surprised for this time Okay, three, two, one And it's upside down And who'd I get? I got Sandu! Again! Woo! I think that's it for B1A4. So let's move on next to K and K. Yeah, let's go chronological order for K and K. Cause K and K are like my babies right now. Like can you can you see? Can you see? Can you see? Can you see? Yeah. With the with the long long legs. Oh, long legs. Long, long legs. Yeah. Okay, so first we have Awake. I didn't ask them to get me a uh, knock because that's actually out of print, their debut album. And I ended up buying that off of someone on eBay because she got like the M Wave signed ones. And like, it was crazy. I was like, I need this in my life. Okay. Just opening this. This one's like a box. Oh, and then K and K albums always come with a standee, so it's like I can double the chances of getting your bias. And my bias is Sung Jun with the the tallest one, with the long legs. Oh, so cute! Alright, I'm gonna close my eyes ish because I know it's like sitting on top. Oh, I can't see. <gasps> oh, I'm so happy. Okay, so for the photo card, I got in song. And then for the standee, got my boy Song Jun. Ooh, he's like laying down and all that fun stuff. Now next we have Remain, which is that poster. 
Oh, the sand is peeking out a little bit, like, like not like I can see, you can see what it is, but it's like kind of like at the edge, so maybe you smash a little bit. Oh, that's okay. Oh, this one has a nice like feel to it, like like a nice bounded book. Okay. And no, that's wrong. Oh yeah, okay. Got in song again. And let's see the standee. I got my boy Song Jun. Yay, two for two on the standees. Woo! So cute. So excited. And wait, I got in song again. It's like so in song is actually my friend's bias. So like, it would have like, this joke going on because when I went to their high touch at KCON. Um, in, I wanted to, because in song is Sabrina Chalk's favorite. So I wanted to be like, my friend loves you. But that would have been weird. This is all mentioned in my KCON vlog, so you know, click up there. Up there. Up there. One of these sides. Click. Next up, recent. Most recent. Not re most. Okay, second most recent comeback. If you don't count. Most reason come back if you don't count the repackaged gravity. And someone's selling this on eBay, like all member autographs, so I'm debating on getting that one as well. The packaging for this one I'm not too crazy about because Rain was packaged the same exact way where it's like this slot, like the slip. So like putting it back in, it gets kind of like bumps into the edges and it kind of ruins it so I'm not too crazy about that okay this is the CD Let's put that back I know I put the bigger piece back in first so oh okay three two one okay so this is stand E I got I got Jihoon 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 and if only I got Hunjin again, that'd be great. Okay, let's see. And ah, oh. ah, oh, I got Hunjin for the photo card. Oh, oh yeah, this um one they had like baby pictures. Oh, and then for the stickers, I got Jihoon. Yeah, the it's like stickers that he drew. Yeah. Oh my God, they're so cute. Oh my wait, they're, they're, they're so cute. Can you guys see these? All back, and I'll show you how much of a pain in the butt this is to back together. Okay. Right. Just put this through the slip, and then it gets a lot of times it bumps into the top piece, and then put this back in. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, in my rain one, it kind of like bumps in here a lot so it's almost like it's kind of wearing out but kind of it's a bummer next we have monster x rush this is the official version yes yeah this is the official version and then the secret version is the blue one which i already have i bought that when i went to korea like a couple years ago so as you all should know from my previous unboxings or if you don't know my bias is wanho so we always pray for wanho when it comes to Monster X. Okay. Oh, and the bias record, of course. Kill Wanda Minhyuk. I when I got the secret version for this, I got Wanho and I was like so happy. Okay, three. Young Wan, woo! Okay. Bias record, bias or bias record, I am cool with that. Okay. And then next we have this yeah, Clan Part 2 Guilty Innocent version. Three, two, one. Kill one again. Ooh. Two for two with bias records. I'm okay with that. It's okay. I can always just buy their photo cards on eBay. Next, we have 
boyfriend's debut album, Boyfriend. And I don't think this came with a photo card, so we're just gonna, you know, open it and be for like prosperity and happiness reasons. Oh. But I will also have every single boyfriend album because after this. Oh, it's so thin. But oh, it's so cute. Okay. And next up is their second mini album. So the one that came right after this, I'm pretty sure. For Don't Touch My Girl. I don't think there's a photo card in this one either, but let's just open it anyways. Fun fact. Don't Touch My Girl is actually both Youngman and Kwamin's favorite boyfriend song. Yes. Fun fact. Okay. And last for the boyfriend albums is Janice. So this one, when it came out, it was actually, they actually came out with a special edition one where it's like a certain number on the cover. But I think this is the normal edition one. So it's just going to be, like, I think this is just like the cover. I'm not sure if these come with a photo card or not. I don't think they do. I've watched many like unboxing videos of this before and I didn't see anything. So because like with the special edition ones, like obviously the member is on the cover. So that's like the one like special thing about them. Janice is actually my, one of my, my friend's favorite song from Boyfriend and it's actually the first song I ever heard from them like when I was just scrolling through like YouTube and it would put in my like recommended videos list and I watched it and then instantly I was hooked on Boyfriend like it's not my chrome theme anymore but for the longest time the young man Janice was my Chrome theme, and it. My friends thought it was really creepy because whenever I opened a new tab, you know, would just stare you down. <laughs> but I liked it, and that's what matters. Next up, we have two Vix things, and one of these Vix things I am very excited for. So, oh, you guys can already see this one. This is their newest comeback. The I forgot like what it's like called, but the title track is Shangri La. There's two versions of this, Birth Flower and Birth Stone. I think this is, I think this is Stone. We'll see. Red version and green version. And then this one comes with a bookmark and a photo card. Originally, I wasn't going to get this one just because the photo card is like folded, like a, like, like a card. And I was like, oh, I'm not, not sure how I feel about that, but I want since Vix is like one of my like one of my bias groups, I want to collect all of them. So I'm kind of getting a slow start to that because I right currently I only have Chained Up and Jekyll, and they actually have so many albums. It's crazy. Okay, so. This is the bookmark. This is this is Hyuk's. Okay, and then this one. If it's not upside down. <gasps> okay. Okay, if I didn't just make it obvious, Leo is my big bias. Ah so happy. Okay. Cause I got N for Jekyll and I was like, but Leo though. So yeah, I'm happy. Yay! Hooray for Vix. Yeah, I think the in Change Up I got Ken. So, but I was so cool with that. Oh, dang! Another like slip packaging, which I'm not too crazy about when you put it. I had to put it back in a slip. 
So then the slip gets kind of damaged and it bothers me. Okay. And last but not least, I was I have been waiting to open this for so long. Is the Conception Trilogy. This thing is so big. But oh, I, when when this came out, I was like, I need to have this. Because it, it was a special package for when during their Conception Trilogy, obviously. And then it came with a special key keychain. And I collect keys and I was crazy. I like had to have this, except this was like sixty dollars in wherever I, I wanted to find try to find it. Like at the album store in K Town, it was like sixty six dollars. But this is like thirty dollars in Korea, so I was like, please, please, please get this for me. Oh, so excited. Oh. Oh my god, it's so nice. Yep, here it goes. Oh. The key. It's actually kind of flimsy. Okay, I'll just remember to like really protect it. Oh, it's so pretty though. Oh my god. I, this is what I was most excited for, like this piece. And then, of course, in here is where. Wait, what? Oh yes, this, this is a foam piece because there was so much space in here because it's meant to fit the entire like trilogy albums if you have them to put inside. I don't have them but I am planning to buy all three of them. And in here is the photo, yeah, so two special photo books for the trilogy. I will go through them later because I'm pretty sure. Ooh, ooh, I'm going through them now. I lied, I guess. Ooh, oh, that's so pretty. I will more in depthly go through them later. So yes, when I get the rest of like, when I get the trilogy, I will be sure to fit them inside here. Okay, so let's put the foam back in to protect all of them. And my camera is about to die. Oh my god. Oh, hello, baby guys. Hello. Okay, so camera died. So I had to resort to filming with my phone for the time being while it charges. So, hope you guys enjoy the video. I certainly enjoy watching people unbox albums. Like, there's this one point during finals week where I just watch people unbox like K pop hauls and didn't do any work so hopefully you're not in that situation now and you actually have time to be watching this but you know until my next video see you guys